Only on 11 Alive, an investigation is underway into allegations of bullying at her county high school following the recent suicide of a freshman student. Last night, a vigil was held for 15 year old Austin McIntyre. He took his own life on November 6. Close to 100 people showed up to remember this young man's life. 11 Alive's Cody Alcorn, he was at that vigil and spoke with Austin's mom. He was 15. This shouldn't have happened. This is 15 year old Austin McIntyre. He had so much going for him. He was an AB student, mostly A's, but a few B's now and then. He was athletic on both football and track. On Friday morning, November 4th, Lisa says Austin didn't want to go to school, told her he was sick. The two went back and forth. Turned out he wasn't sick, but it was a lot worse. I, I specifically said, we please be honest with me? And he said, I'm being bullied at school. A Wednesday, they did what's called pants me. They pants him with his shorts and underwear. Lisa says she called the school. The principal assured her the incident was being investigated. The next day. Saturday, when I got home from work, we had a a beautiful afternoon. Then Sunday, Lisa McIntyre's life changed forever. And that morning I got up, went to work, called him at 926, had a brief conversation with him and said, I love you. I'll see you in a little while. And he said he loved me too. And that was it. It would be Lisa and Austin's last phone call. The next call was from the Heard County Sheriff's Office. Deputies were at her house. And Lisa rushed home and I already knew he, it wasn't good. I said he's gone and he shook his head yes. And I just completely lost it. As Lisa continues to grieve, she's fighting for change. I want kids to be kind and, and compassionate and inclusive of everybody. They, they don't need to isolate kids and make them feel like they're not worth something. That was Cody Alcorn reporting. The school district said in a statement there's an ongoing investigation into claims of bullying as well as other events which have been brought to light by law enforcement.